Coming up next on The Jeff Crilly Show, we're going to be talking about customer experience with an expert, her journey just ahead. Many are predicting that the worst is yet to come, which is unfortunate, said one person here. Until now, they've enjoyed the reputation of being the nation's icebox. Watched a burglar in his home this morning by webcam. As a journalist of over 25 years, stories are what make my world turn. Reporting live from the Dallas Newsroom tonight, Jeff Crilly, Fox 4 News. But in 2008, I took the jump from my familiar life and started a PR firm from my home. We're talking about anyone with a camcorder like the one I'm using becomes a television network. We started is slowly growing the company and we now have over a hundred clients and we've branched into the world of live digital broadcasting. I now own eight different TV studios and have a huge team and the stories that I now get to share are sometimes the most important of my life. Life has a funny way of coming around full circle. This is the Jeff Crilly Show. My company, you know, I am passionate about customer service and the client experience. And so from the moment you come to the big shiny tower, to the greeting at the front desk, to do we have the right snacks for people? Um, I'm all about client experience. And so I met this young lady a couple of weeks ago and I was fascinated by her. She is uh, Wendy Wagner. She is the VP of client experience at AIS. Yes. Welcome to the show. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. Thanks for having me. I don't think I've ever heard uh, VP of client experience before. Mm -hmm. Tell us about that. Well, um, <clears throat> it's exactly what, I mean, it's all about the client experience, right? Everybody needs to feel like they're special and they're a part of something. And my job is the my, is the best in the company, I think, because I get to talk to all the clients, all the prospects, talk to them, what's great about AIS and why, why AIS? What is it about us that differentiates us from others? And so for me, I get to um, interview clients, understand what their goals are, what their challenges are, where they're, you know, where do they see themselves in, in next year and five years, and how could we be a part of that solution and helping them do business better? Tell us more about the company. <clears throat> so AIS is a fintech company here in Dallas, Texas is where we're based. And we have a large operations in India where we do technology, talent, and data. So any type of industry requires technology to be efficient and talented people to do the work. And so at AIS, we're focused on how can we be a solution for our clients in a sense of either technology resources, operations, or just building automation to help them do business better, right? Um, bots, they don't, they don't take a break. They don't, they don't need time off. So everyone's looking for ways to, um, I guess, lower their operating expenses, right? So from AIS perspective, we can cut costs up to 50%. And so it's so good to be able to go in and say, you know, how can I help? What are you, what's keeping you up at night? And for them to share some of their challenges and, and then let's say, let's look at a solution together. And it's really a, a partnership. So that's what we do. And, and it's so fun because I get to meet so many cool people, right? And networking. Amazing. Yeah. We found a great video, it's an overview. Let's go ahead and roll that now. In today's ever-changing business climate, it can be hard to find the right people with the right skills and support them with the right technology. But AIS can help. We're a Texas-based FinTech firm offering data analytics, technology, and talent to support operations and IT functions within the financial services sector all while delivering the lowest cost per unit at client-defined quality levels. When it comes to digital transformation, AIS blends tech and talent to optimize efficiency and cut loan servicing costs up to 50%. So how do we do it? We develop software robotics with AI that integrate with core banking systems, automating up to 80% of loan admin work at a 99.4% accuracy rating across 170 banking processes. Where automation cannot be deployed, we rely on our highly skilled workforce that is 100% college educated with 30% holding secondary degrees. By leveraging our staff augmentation and automation capabilities, your business can operate 24-7, reducing cycle times and improving scalability. And lastly, we equip bank decision makers with deep data sets and forward-thinking analytics so they can make smarter business decisions and create better customer experiences. At AIS, our business is helping you do business better, so you can focus on the big picture no matter how much your business grows. Let's build a better business together. Learn how you accelerate your digital journey by partnering with AIS today.
Wow, well, that was a great video, right? Yeah. Talk all about our banking transformation solution. So we're working with a ton of banks right now in understanding how we can make them more efficient, as I was describing. Um, but the good news is the favorite part of my job is we don't just work with banks, right? We work with uh, insurance companies. We work with um, mortgage servicers, auto servicers, very large servicers. And a lot of them here are in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. So we get to have coffee with them. We get to go meet them for lunch. We get to go to their office now that Everyone's allowed to start doing that and really just get to know them and their business and how we can be a part of their solution. So for us, it's been really great because, um, you know, I started uh, in mortgage um, and really was in operations and, and knew all the other side of it um, because I was on the side of where my clients are today. And so when I came into the business, I could say, you know, I understand how you feel. I felt the same way. And what I found is it takes a village, right? We've got to be able to have good partners and really good professionals to help us get where we want to go. And so um, a story that I love and I'm able to share that, you know, from a personal experience uh, with someone who's never worked with a partner like AIS. And it was a new industry. It was an in insurance. And I was just very, I could tell they were struggling with some things internally. And my goal was just to listen and understand, you know, what is it that's that's bothering you so much? You know, where where is it? Where did it start? Where are you at today with it? And how can I potentially help you? And so um, they had never worked with anyone uh, that was an external partner and let alone someone Someone who had operations in India and they just were really nervous and I said let's just let me just share my personal experience when I worked um, like a, at a company like yours and I chose to work with a company like AIS that had operations in India and um, I just really got very just a personal testimony from me and she just everything just felt better for her and she said you know what I'm really interested what are next steps and um, you know, she wanted to retire at 60, but she just felt like, you know, she'd been doing such great things for, you know, she was ahead of our, their operations. And I said, just, just let us let, let us help you. And working together, we started out small is like we, what we like to do to build that trust and confidence, start baby steps, show them what we're capable of as partners, right? It's not just AIS, it's, it's working with their great um, team as well. And we become one. And what we did is we were able to help her in all the areas that she was always worried about keeping her up at night. And we started with talented resources. We came in, started with five, helped her. Wow, that was really easy. That was fun. Oh, thank you. I mean, can you can we do a little bit more? Can we do this? And so we ended up um, getting to close to 100 people that helped her team just, just really augment staff augmentation, right? Really just helps your team become better because you need more resources, more more talent, um, and now we're looking at automation and how can we make the process much more efficient. And um, you never want to automate a bad process because then bad things just happen sooner. So how do you make it the best it can be and then automate where it makes sense and, and really have that true transparency into the process and understand, you know, um, wow, that really cut my cost. It brought in a better quality and the efficiency is amazing. So I, I love to be able to share my personal testimony because I think it helps people understand that I've been there and I know, you know, I can share my, my experience and, you know, experiences of other clients. And, and so I love that we work in all different types of industries where we have the ability to share our technology, talent, and data. So, That's awesome. Yeah. And I, I know it starts at the top. Tell us about your CEO. So Blake Hogan is the founder and uh, CEO of AIS. Uh, we've been in business for well over 20 years. Started out in data, and he can tell his story much better than me. So, But I will say that in, in the time that I've been here, um, I was at City for City Group, great company, worked there for 17 years and enjoyed every single minute of it. It was in culture, in, um, in sales, in operations, and it was just so much fun. I felt like the development and the the um, training and the mentorship there was amazing and it helped me get to where I'm at today. And with Blake, he was very, he was growing his company at that time, six years ago, there was about 350 people and now we're at a thousand. Um, and so he came to me a couple years ago and said, you know what, I really need someone to run our client base. Our, and he was like, would you be interested? And I was like, you know, I love the clients. This is the best part of my job. I get to talk to so many great people. I get to help them with a solution to what's what's keeping them up at night. And so, um, 
like I said, we've, we've gone from 350 people in the last six years since I've been here to 1,000, and a lot of that is because it's so important for us to make sure our clients are happy, that they feel like we're there when they need us, and we're always looking for a solution that could help them. And so um, so I, I'm very thankful that that's his vision, and it's really worked, right? We've we've over tripled in, in size. So. Yeah. Congrats on your yeah. success, and I'm not surprised. You. Let's Thank talk you. about uh, company culture. What's the, what's the culture like there? Well, we have indie operations, right? So uh, we used to have our own magazine uh, before the pandemic where everybody got to tell a little bit of a success story. Uh, we, we um, because we, we do have an India operations um, that works with the US banking and financial institutions here, we want them to feel very comfortable talking to our clients and our clients to feel comfortable talking to them. So we do a lot of training with um, conversational English. They watch Cheers, they watch Friends, and it's like, they are just like you and I. I mean, they, they know when to laugh, right? Sometimes when you're in another country, you're like, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do right now. So I learned so much from them, but they, it, the culture, the the ex, just the, the talent that they have, they're all 100% um, college educated. 30% of them have um, secondary degrees, and they just their their goal in life to, of success is to work for a U.S. company. So it makes me so proud to know that we've been a part of bringing um, you know them business to really be successful. Um, AIS is the biggest uh, employer in Vidoja, India, which is where. Um, we have two, uh, our major operations and it's funny when i've been there i've been to india several times and i walk in i feel like i'm just in the u.s like i'm walking and i'm like oh the, the colors i mean it's like white and blues and there's just people smiling everywhere there's pictures of all the events that they do and what i think is so awesome is that um they are always so happy to work for somebody that really enjoys that partnership they just want to make our clients smile right but when we walk in and you see all the great things you're doing you're like it's it's just pretty amazing so um it's it's it, the most important thing to me is when i interview my clients and i say why why did you choose as why are you still with us i know there's vendors and partners knocking on your door all the time and they're like I can tell you all these things and they're telling me, I'm like, it just makes my heart uh, so happy because my goal is for them to be with someone that they like to do business with and they're getting the results that they're looking for. So um, obviously you can see I'm very passionate about it. So um, my clients are what make my day and I'm very grateful to have that experience with them. So Okay, so final thoughts. What would you like to leave the audience with? Well, I would just like to say, you know, if you're ever having any challenges with your company from you know, just not finding the right resources, uh, not being able to get things done um, as quickly as you want, and maybe just not having transparency into the things that you do. AIS is here to support you and be that partner that you've always wanted that you never knew you needed, right? And so how can, uh, you know, you just do things better? Our business is helping you do business better. So um, always reach out to us. We're, we're happy to help. So, Wendy, you've been yeah. an amazing guest. Thank you so much. Thank you. We're going to end with the website, which is AmericanInfoSource.com. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Oh, I, I really appreciate it. Thank yeah. you. That's it for now. We'll see you next time.